Hi, this is Mike from Street Moto Z. Today we're going to do chain maintenance on this beautiful 2023 Ninja 650. I'm going to take you through every step of the way. We're going to look at the tools that's going to be needed to do the chain maintenance. Some of the chain maintenance is going to include tightening the chain and getting it to manufacturer specifications and also cleaning that chain and lubing it. For today's maintenance, these are the tools that we're going to be using. We're going to be using a jack stand, but I'm going to show you how to do all of this without a jack stand. It's good to have gloves, a breaker bar, a torque wrench, a pair of regular pliers, a pair of needle nose pliers, a 22 millimeter socket, a 27 millimeter socket, a tape measure, a small 8 millimeter socket with a ratchet, an open end wrench, a 13 millimeter wrench will work, a hammer, a metric ruler. There's a lot of different kinds of dissolvents that you can use. I'm going to be using WD-40. We need some chain lube, a few rags, and a drop cloth. The first thing we're going to do is adjust the chain slack. And this is the chain slack right here. You measure it. You don't push hard down or hard up. You push medium to medium and you measure that distance and that's the distance for a ninja 650 we want it to be between 20 millimeters and 30 millimeters this chain slack that i measured is right at 35 millimeters i'm going to try to get it down to about 20. an overview of what we're going to do to adjust the chain slack is we're going to loosen this nut that's under this boot once this is loosened we'll be able to adjust the chain slack with this nut and there's another on the other side
Once you do this maintenance, you'll find that your Ninja 650 will ride smoother and accelerate smoother. Well, I hope this video helps some of you guys out there. Please like and subscribe. It really helps. And remember, it's not about the destination. It's about the ride, baby.